kick-ass switch, putting the K in magic. I'm Joanna DeVoe, and you're watching a video about potatoes. <laughs> Just kidding. I want to talk about negativity and drama. I often hear people complaining about negativity and drama. It could be in their relationships, or at work, or even online. Uh, and I'm here to tell you that if you're complaining about it, you are perpetuating it. I'm assuming you're all familiar with the game Hot Potato, that maybe it depends, maybe it's a generational thing, but in my generation we played a game called Hot Potato, and you'd play music, and there'd be like a bean bag that you had to toss back and forth and around a circle, and when the music stopped, whoever got caught holding the bean bag would be out. So I want you to imagine though that you're playing hot potato with a literal hot potato and it's so hot it's burning your hands and your enemy <laughs> and you are playing this game of hot potato and you're throwing the hot potato back and forth, you know, the second it hits your hands it's really hot so you throw it back at the person who threw it at you and then they throw it back at you and you really, you just keep the game going forever. The best way to stop the game is that when that hot potato is flying at you, just step aside and let it hit the ground. Now the person that you're playing the game with might run over and pick that hot potato back up and chuck it at you again, but if you step aside enough times and let it hit the ground, they're eventually going to get bored or frustrated and just go on to find someone else that will play this little game with them. And believe me, there are much better, more fun games that you can be playing in life. So don't waste it playing negative hot potato with your so-called enemy. It's a waste of time and like all things, negativity begets more negativity. So you're just inviting it in the longer you play that game from other people and from all different kinds of situations. So my advice, drop the potato and walk away. Much love. Peace.